Josephine, she knows I went to the school. There's no, no, that's not right. Josephine! 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 Come here, go. She already thinks you're going to. Uh -uh. We're going to school. Which school? Didn't I tell you last night that I'll be going to the farm this morning to complete the work at the farm? Yes, you said so, but I said I would do that farm work immediately I return from school. Yeah. So today is our quiz. Okay, I said so. And you decide to take the decision on your own. Come on, go and drop that bag and go to the farm for me. Uh uh. Mama, she says she will go when she comes after. Will you shut up and go to school? Ah, Ah. Ijima, what are you still doing here? You've not gone to school. I'm leaving now. Did you hear what, 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 what Mama is, is saying? Uh -uh. What did she say? That will go, she's not going to school. Uh huh. And how is that my business? Come, let's go. Go to school. Lawyer. I'm going to go. You rock all day. Go to school. Me, me, I'm not going anywhere. Beat me. I'm not going anywhere. Oh, Maka. Since you go, she's not going anywhere, Mama. I'm not going anywhere. I'm going back to the house. You better start going to school now, okay? It's Oma. It's Oma. Look at this girl. Go to school. Because go inside and Please, Look at me, my mates are no longer in this school now. Please let me finish now. I'm begging you. Okay. Please, now. When you finish crying, you go to the farm. It's drama. You don't want to take money for me. Mama, what are you doing? Mama, I Mm -hmm. hey. I'm tired and I'm thirsty. I need to rest. Okay. Is the water still remaining? Yes. Still there. You got one more. Hey. Oh. So the phone is just too much. Nah. You are drugable. Hey. Come on, me. Ugo, come and rest now. Must you finish this work today? You could be as weak. Yes, so oh, I must finish it. So I can be able to go to school tomorrow. You saw what happened this morning. I missed my quiz. I don't want to miss it again tomorrow. And I don't want what happened this morning to repeat itself again. I don't have strength for your mother, please. Ugo, this is exactly what I'm saying. Go to think of it. You're not the only person in that house. Josephine is there. I myself is there too. Why are you the only one that my mother stopped from going to school and asked you to come and work in this farm alone? Look at the time that we're here. And Josephine is in school. Suppose I did not come here with you, so you'll be the only one walking here all alone. What if all these village boys that are gallivanting around come here and they rape you? What will you do? Eh? Now tell me, what did you do to them? I want to know. Please. I've done nothing to them. You can bear me witness. You and I know that I've done nothing wrong to your parents. They just hate me for no just cause. And all this started when... When my parents died, I don't want to talk about it. All I want to do right now is to finish this work so I can be able to go to school tomorrow. I don't want to keep repeating class. I don't want to keep repeating class. I have repeated so much and it's not good. Look at me. I'm still in secondary school. I'm supposed to be in the university by now. Please, let's just forget about everything and work. Please. Because if you're tired, don't worry. Relax. Let me continue with the work. I must finish it today. I made 1,900 naira. Your own is 1,750 naira. Well, I thank God for today. At least today I didn't go in vain. What do you mean by well, you thank God for today? My brother, you should be grateful. It's not easy to make money. Look now. at it. Did I tell you I'm not happy? I said I thank God for today. Is that a wrong statement? The way you're presenting it, eh, I thank God. I won't concern you. Some people are even desperate for 500 uh, naira. You are here. Make so I get one naira. Thank you. 
Uh huh. See, I want to tell you something. Uh, so what is it? You are truly a friend. Since I came into this village, you've been um, more like a brother to me. You've been showing me love, you accommodated me, you've been, in fact, you are my brother. I really appreciate. Chimobi, is that why you're bothering yourself? What are friends for? See, immediately I saw you enter this village. My mind told me that you're a good person. And even up till now, I still see you as a good person. That's my point. It's not easy to accommodate a total stranger. So you showed me love, I appreciate. Secondly, I want to tell you that I've gotten my own one room. Somewhere around. The what? One room. Tell me why? Why would you go and look for your own house elsewhere? When you know my own house is still vacant for you any day, any time. See, if I offended you in any way, you're supposed to talk to me. Not for you to go and look for your own house elsewhere. Would you go and waste that type of money? No, 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 no. My brother, we are still in order. Trust me. I appreciate the fact that you want us to be together. Fine and good. But I am a man. I need to start up. At... Okay, now, think of it. I have siblings. I have parents. They might come visit me someday. And I won't bring them to your own room. So I need my own room. Please. Yeah? So please, we are not about I need to have my own room. Okay? Well, it's okay. Uh, I understand you. It's okay, no problem. I'm happy for you. Congratulations anywhere. <laughs> but we must launch your new house or launch what? it. Launch what? Launch yeah. more new. That one concerns we must celebrate it too. We have to feel empty. That one concerns you. We must launch it and don't I must drink for it. Don't mock me, the house is still empty. Don't have what no map you have to That's why I see I'm uh the roof is big old. How are you going to polish this house? I mean, buying a bed, TBD, phone, and all that. So many things. My brother, I used to go down to Buenaca. I know, I know, I know. The good news is that I now have my own room. As a furnishing, the room will furnish itself. <laughs> ah. Well, that is true anyway. I'm happy for you. Mm. But I must drink for it. My one book. Must take my one bottle. Must you drink? Uh huh. Must you drink? It's a new thing. We are celebrating it. You must drink for it, of course. You want to drink a cup before you? If I now buy a house, what will you do? You go and use your drink. Pure eh? water, come here. Close here. You are with my friend. Pure water is what I mean. Take your time, boy. I drink. Take your time. Take your one bottle. If you are one, you want to drink. If I now buy a house, what will you do? I will use my phone. Hey, Jama. Mama, you're not looking happy. What is it? Mama, I'm not happy at all. You are not happy? Yes, Papa. Ijoma, why are you not happy? Papa, Mama, I want to ask, what did the go to do to you and Josephine that made you hate her like this? What has she done? I want to understand. Because nothing she does in this house pleases any of you. Is it because of this nonsense? You are looking so moody. Mama, my question is not nonsense. So. I need to know, please. It's okay. I think I'll tell her. My daughter, I will tell you. Hmm? Now you listen. In matters like this, you are still a very small girl. But since you insist and you want to know, I don't mind, I'll tell you. You see, Ugochi's left father was my elder brother. He was a very, very wicked man when he was alive. He refused to give me my own share of the family land and property. Even when I pleaded with him to give me my own land so that I can sell it and help myself. He still refused. It became very clear to me 
that he never wanted anything good for me. When I wanted to marry a mother here, I never had a dime. I know what I suffered. I know the hell I went through to raise money so that I can do the necessary marital things on your mother said. But as God may have it, he was coming back from an occasion with the wife when he had an accident and both of them died. And since then I decided I must pay him back in his coins by dealing with his own children. That is exactly what I'm doing now. And I don't think I'll stop until I am satisfied. Papa, do you know you're not a nice person? All those things you just narrated now, how does it concern Ugochi and her brother? Is that enough reason for you to be treating them like this? Papa, it's not fair now. Look at the little Onyebuchi. He's supposed to be in school now. You sent him to go and learn a uh, um, uh, motor mechanic. Papa, is it fair? Okay, early this morning, we are prepared to go to school. Mama asked to go to, to go back and drop her school bag school. and go to the farm. At her age, she's still in secondary school. Papa, all these things has to stop. Oh. And to you, Sister Josephine, you should remember that Sister Ogochi is a young girl like you. And a sister too. Nobody knows tomorrow. Shut up there. All right, all right. I think this discussion is over now. Papa? You're not saying anything. Mama, please, 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 please. What is it? Don't ever call me again. <laughs> Reverend Sister Ijama. So it is because of this nonsense he just ranted here that made you to call us all out here at this time of the night. Huh? I can see that you have started to grow wings. Don't worry. I know what to do. You can go to bed now. I'm not ready to go to bed. I said go to bed. Good night. Mama. Sister Josephine, God is watching the two of you. I heard everything. I heard everything that your father said. So your father is happy. He's happy that my parents are dead. Why? What wrong have we ever done to him in this house? What? Is that why he treats my brother and I like we are outcasts? Even if my late parents offended him, did Onyebuchi and I ever do anything to him? Have we ever done anything wrong to him? Did we? Please stop crying. Hmm? Even if everybody in this house hates you, I, Ijoma, is solidly behind you. Anything anybody wants in this house, I shall give them double. No, 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 please, Ijoma. It has not gotten to that. My head is full already. I don't want any more problem in this house like the one that is already happening. I don't want. They are your parents. And Josephine is your elder sister. And you're my sister too. I know, but, but they don't know that. There's no but in this issue. Hmm? Just leave them. 
as we in an young Please, please just stop crying. It's okay now. Stop crying. It's okay. It's okay. It's been just one kiss. Okay, have you eaten? No, Queen. You're not hungry. Okay. I'm going to get food for you now. Uh -uh. What's you kill yourself because of these people? I'm going to let me go and get it for you. You must eat. Uh -uh. Mama, I'm sorry. Mama, why do you have to leave us like this? Why do you have to leave so early for us to suffer like this in this world? It's drizzling. Why are you walking under the rain? You put me alone for a mic. Eh? Timothy, it's not that I'm power mic or anything. I know it's raining, yes. But see, I, I need money. You need money. Let's go and walk. You need enough money. You need money. If you don't need money, yet, whether rain or no rain, let the rain fall from now to tomorrow. I will walk. I need money. I need enough money. That's you. I need money, fine and good, but my health is more important. My waist is spending me. This, 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 this work is too stressful. It's too stressful. Ah, my waist is spending me. Pas Hmm. Quelle ah. ouïe. Ugochi. Onko. Good afternoon. Why are you coming back home at this time of the day? Eh? Goji, why are you not in school? Uncle, I was sent out of school because because I've not paid my school fees. Goji, in that case, there is no cause for alarm. Hmm? That means you have to be in the house. Go in there. Drop your bag and join my wife at the farm. Uncle, please, please help me and pay my fees. I'm begging you. You have paid for Josephine and, and the drama. Please, I don't want to stay at home, please. Yes, because they are my own children. Gosh, are you my child? And did I give birth to you? Uncle, but you are my uncle. I am your late brother's daughter. Thank God, you have said it with your own mouth. My late brother's daughter. If you want to remain in school, go out there, make the money, and pay your school fees. Or forget everything about school. Uku, Uku, please don't do this to me. Ugochi, please give me a break. Give me a break. Now leave my presence. 
Uncle, Leave my presence! <laughs> Go and wake your useless father from the grave. Come and pay your school fees. Also, Jim, they will never learn my trouble. Hello, hello, uh huh. Oh, yeah, would you? Uh, it's me, Ugochi, your sister. No, it's not my phone. I'm calling you with Uju's phone. But there is a problem, oh. It's uncle. He, he, he has stopped me from schooling. He said he doesn't have money to, to pay for my school fees anymore. I don't know. I don't know. I didn't do anything to him. No, no, see, I'm not telling you this for you to worry yourself. I'm only telling you for you to know the situation of things in the house. I hope you are learning your work. You are concentrating. Please just concentrate for me, Biko. Since he doesn't want to train you in school, so that you have something to hold on to. I know. Don't worry. Don't worry. I will, I will keep calling you with this number. Do that, don't cry. I'll call you. I'll call you. Your uncle is very wicked. What is wrong with him? So what are you going to do now? I don't know, honestly. This is how my uncle behaves all the time. I don't know what I've done wrong to him. Just take a good look at me. Am I supposed to be in secondary school at my age? When my mates are in the university? Because of what my uncle is doing to me. <laughs> you definitely pass <laughs> through this place. You know, go. Let me see you. Sorry, bro. Oye, Gucci. Oye, Gucci. Why are you sitting down here? Have you finished the work or got asked you to do in that truck? Honestly, I'm confused. I don't know what I'm doing again. <laughs> I can't just concentrate anymore. How? I don't understand. What happened? My sister got to just go me right now. Not my uncle, I just stop paying her school fees. Why is he doing that? I don't know. I can't just tell. Since my parents died, I and my sister have been passing through here in that house. Now look at me, a boy of my age, learning mechanic. Uh, why my mate are in the school doing well? <laughs> and my uncle told me to do this. So, I will advise you to learn this mechanic well. Look around this country today. Every good mechanic is earning big money. He's living fine. He's a comfortable man. If your uncle sending you to learn motor mechanic just to wicked you, I want you to prove him wrong. You hear? You have to understand, understand that. It's okay. It's okay. Go back to work. Yeah? Is that? Yeah. Welcome. 
Fine. How was school? School was fine. What happened? Why did you leave the school so early? And I was searching for you everywhere during the break time. I was inside the class after the assembly ground when when the principal came in and called me up with two other girls and asked us to leave because we have not bought the new school uniform and we've not paid our fees. I I pleaded with him. I I begged him. I even laid down on the floor that I was going to pay later and he refused. He sent us out of the class. So I had to come back. And what did Papa say when you returned home? Your father said that I have to stop schooling. That he can no longer pay my fees. That if I insist that I want to school then I will have to take care of my fees by myself. Are you serious? My father said that. Yes. Uguchi, are you sure? What do you mean, am I sure? Will I lie against your father? You can ask him. You can ask him. Why? Yeah, but... Why do you have to wash your dirty clothes and left mine, knowing that they are equally dirty? Why? Are you alright? What kind of approach is that? <laughs> am I alright? Is it that you are deaf? Or do I have water in my mouth that he did not hear me clearer? Now let me rephrase. I said, why did you leave my dirty clothes and washed only your stinking clothes? Wait! Let me ask you, when did it become Ogochi's duty to wash your dirty clothes? Can't you wash your clothes? Yeah? Pijono, I'm more Josephine. Your elder sister that you're talking to like that. I am going to squeeze you. You may go say. Because I can see you don't have respect for me anymore. Huh? Respect. You should respect yourself before looking for someone to respect you. Can't you do your laundry? Give me, me. Oh, now I see. There are both of you planters. Now watch me. Josephine did Sugochi's clothes. All because Sugochi refused to wash her, 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 her dirty clothes. And so what is wrong in my daughter Josephine asking her to wash her clothes? Oh, is Mama. that why people are here making noise? Mama, oh, please. Like you, I am going to squeeze this your mouth. You cannot do anything. Why oh, yeah, twist it? Twist my lips. You. Oh, my God. You go. You said you wanted to tell me something. This is it. You know you're the closest person to me in this house. And for that singular reason, I cannot do anything without letting you know. Since your father, my uncle, has refused to, to train me in school, I cannot be seated doing nothing. So I, I have decided to start up something, no matter how small, I need to start up something that will be giving me money so I can be able to pay my fees. Hey John, I need to go to school. I need to. Oh my God. So what do you want to start? And the money to even start it with? I already spoke with my friend Uju. I pleaded with her to lend me some money so I can start up grandma business. I don't mind to hawk. I mean, if that's the only solution for me to go back to school, then I will. I need to make my late parents proud. 
My brother is already serving somewhere as a mechanic. I don't need to be a school dropout. I must go to school. So, would you be a nice person? She has already given me the money. So, oh. I, I will start. Mm -hmm. She's such a nice person. May God bless her. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I want you to do something for me. Hmm? I want you to stop thinking about what my parents and Josephine are doing to you in this house. I strongly believe that one day God will wipe away your tears and you'll forever be happy. Oh? Please, just wipe your tears. Hmm? I don't even know how to thank you. I don't know how to thank you for everything you have done for me in this house. You are, you are everything to me. Thank you for your love, your, your care, your encouragement. I mean, without you in this house, I would have committed suicide. It's okay. Your happiness is my concern. Hmm? So, when are you starting the business? Okay, um, hopefully next week. I, I think I will start up something. Wow. Thank God. Hmm? I'm happy for you. So, can we go to bed now? I just want to be alone. I need to receive some fresh air before coming inside. You can go. Are you sure? Please. Okay. Well, before then, you need to wipe away your tears. I'm no longer crying. I'm fine. I'm put a smile on your face. Hmm? Thank All you. All right. Don't be too long, go. There is something about that girl. Who could she be? So she's crying all the time. Life is misery daily, and she's so lonely. So she's crying all the time. Father, we thank you. We worship you. Thank you for providing the resource for this business. Thank you for the hand that made it come to pass. Father, I, I commit my sister into your holy hand. At, that as she goes out, she will make profits and customers will locate her. Amen. So that at the end of the day, Amen. your name and your name alone will be exalted. Amen. Thank you, Father, for the Jesus name we pray. Amen. My passport. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you very much. <laughs> Josephine, Josephine, why did you pack that quantity of granite? You know that today is my first day of starting this business. Don't you want me to make profit? And so what? Hey, Joma. Sister Josephine, can you return this granite back, back from where you, to where you collected them from? Uh uh. Why would you pack this quantity of granite? If it's like this, how much do you think she will make by the end of the day? What is wrong with you now? This is not good, Jama. Sister! Papa! This is not fair. Mama! Yeah. This is not fair. Oh. 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 Okay, the part. What is it? What is it? Tell her to drop all, all the granite she, she, she bought from Ugochi's granite. And so, what is wrong if Josephine packed some granite from Ugochi's granite? Oh, Mama, ask her. Ask her. Wait, wait, wait. So, this is why you people are making this kind of noise in my house. Eh? Now, will you both of you go to school? Go to school! Papa, even you! Even me. Let me even see how this yeah. Of course, of course, even at Italian Adam. Even at Italian Adam. 
Uncle. Oh God, this thing you people are doing to me in this house is no good though, it's no good. Do you know the quantity of granola you just collected? Do you know how much? I'm starting this business for the very first time, how do you want me to progress? Oh, how much eh? So you want us to pay for this small granola we took? Mama, what is wrong if she asks you to pay for the granola you collected? Don't you know this is someone's business? It's okay, no problem. No problem at all. Let's go. You pay for the granola. What does you pay for the granola? You pay for the granola. But mind you. But from today onwards, you pay for every food you eat in this house. No. I assure you. No, no, no. I assure you. No, no, Uncle, please don't pay no. for the granola again. I'll manage. I'll manage. Don't worry. Don't pay. Papa, this is not fair. Oh. This is not I fair at all. Go. Come on, go to school. Of uh, course, Your friend has gone, though. Why is the heart so evil? What can she do? Where will she go? Oh, she's crying all the time. Life is misery daily, and she's so lonely. So she's crying all the time. Thank you. I'm gonna hold it. Granato! 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 My son, you said your name is Pascal. Yes, I'm here. And you want to marry one of my daughters? Yes, I'm here. You are welcome. What of your father? Is he still alive? Yes, I'm here. But he went to my younger sister's place at Jones. He went to and see my younger sister and my husband. Then I decided to come and make my interest known to this family. Then anytime he comes back, we'll come and pick up a date mm. for a traditional wedding song. I see. So, which of my daughters do you want to marry? Ugo Tinara. Ugo. Ugo That one. It's, no, it's a no-go area. Besides, she's not my daughter. She is my late elder brother's daughter. Now all I know is that I love Ugo and she is the person that I'm here to marry. I love her, I want to marry her. Do you know her before now? Have you seen her anywhere? No, my. But the person that directed me here told me that she's a good girl. And people have been saying good about her. Honestly, you don't know that girl. You don't know Ugo at all. Moreover, the person or persons that directed you, hmm, they do not know her very well. If you know that girl, my son, you will not have anything to do with her. Besides, Ugochi's father, that is my elder brother, before he died, left a very strict instruction and said that Ugochi should not get married. Because my late brother, the father, had only a male child. 
and she wants to go to stay in the house and bear more children. Moreover, anybody that tries to marry her will not live to see the next day. Hey, now what do I do now? I want to marry that girl. Now husband. you are talking. I like you. I'll give you one of my good daughters to marry. Hmm? Um, Joe, Josephine. Yes, Papa. Please come. And um, greet our guest. You're welcome. Thank you very much. This young man here is Pascal by name. He said he wants to marry you. So, would you like to marry him? Yes, Papa, I'll marry him. If it is the will of God. Oh, I will go. My son, if I you can go back. I'll never go. Hey! What's the meaning of what you just did? I don't understand. What are you talking about? You don't understand. Don't. Okay. Since you have foolishly lost your conscience, I will tell you. That guy that came to uh, seek for Gucci's hand in marriage, and Papa told him all the bad things, which the girl did, did not even do. And you foolishly accepted to marry him. Why? Like Don't tell me you're this desperate by snatching your sister's suit up. Susan, what is wrong with you? Why would you do a thing like that? Like is it me, Josephine, your elder sister, that you're talking to like that? Ijom, are you mad? So, you don't have respect for your seniors anymore. Don't you have respect for me? Respect. I should respect you. You first of all respect yourself. By going to tell Papa to send a message to that fool that you're no longer interested in that marriage. Ijoma, is it my husband that you're referring to as a fool? Huh? Your husband. Did I say uh, um, husband? A man who has not even paid your bride price. He has not done your traditional marriage. And you're here calling him your husband. Ah, I never knew you were this desperate. I don't blame you. Abosu! I knew it. I knew you never wanted anything good for me. Well, Gucci, how is it? It's alright, I'm fine. I heard you talking to your sister about the marriage issue. You shouldn't be bothering yourself over nothing. That man is not my husband. Okay? If your sister wants to go ahead and marry him, then she can continue. Besides, marriage is not my problem for now. Gucci, what kind of a human being are you? You take everything so simple. Because life itself should be simple. Come and help me select my granules, please. Okay. Get a seat now. Get a seat.
What is the meaning of this unexpected gathering? Huh? By the way, who called this meeting? Papa, I did. You did? Yes, Papa. So, what is the meeting all about? Ijoma, I am seated now and I am all ears. So talk to me. Papa, I could not sleep last night. Why? Papa, someone came here yesterday asking for Gochi's hand in marriage. And I was inside when I heard everything you said and how you tarnished to Gochi's image before the man just to achieve your aim. Even swapping Ugochi with Josephine. Papa, why? Ijoma, is this your reason for this unprecedented meeting? Yes, Papa. And I want you to tell us your reasons. Hey, just hold it there. You should have asked Papa to explain the reason to you and not to us. Because I know that Papa had a reason why he did what he did. By the way, who are you to ask Papa that kind of question? Sister Josephine, please do not tell me anything because I can't remember referring to you. I only asked Papa a question and I need an answer. Ask who? Ask for the medicine why you are here. Both of you stop that. Stop that. Ijoma. Papa. Let me ask you. When will you learn to be wise? I ask you again. Will you be happy if Ugochi, another man's daughter, gets married in this house before your own very elder sister? Papa. Answer him. Papa, yeah? point of correction, please. Ugochi is not another man's daughter. Ugochi is your late elder brother's daughter. So automatically, she is your daughter now. Ijoma, you have said it all now. Hmm? You have said it all. Ugochi is my late elder brother's daughter. Mm -hmm. And not my own daughter. So get that clear into your empty head. Anyway, I have done what I want to do. And no going back. I think this discussion is over. Papa! Hmm? Come. Why are you so stupid? To the extent that you are so jealous of your own sister's progress. Eh? Mama, I am not jealous of anybody. All I'm saying is that, is that I don't like the way you are treating Ugochi like an outcast in this house. It's not fair. Oh. <laughs> Tell me what I did to each other. My own blood sister. Josephine. That please. she is always fighting me in my own father's house. Josephine, don't mind her, okay? Don't mind her. Are you sure this girl is my sister? Are you truly sure? Josephine. Manoburo Fuchuku Neke, Biko, please stop stressing yourself over each other. When my parents were alive, my father was having issues with his, his elder brother over a land dispute, which was not settled till my father went for a traditional marriage with my mother at the neighboring village. On their way back, the vehicle they entered had a terrible accident and everyone in the vehicle died, including my parents. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm so sorry about that. Ever since then, my uncle has been treating my younger brother and I like slaves. 
in the same house that my father built before he died. He doesn't take care of us at all. You can imagine my younger brother that is not up to 15 years has been sent to learn mechanic at his age. And me, at my age, I'm still in secondary school. Because he doesn't allow me to go to school often, I keep repeating class. I keep repeating class. So, why are you not in school today? I mean, is this what you do for the living? My, my uncle insisted that if I must continue schooling, then I will be the one to make the money and pay my fees. That he will not take care of my fees anymore. So, I, I met with my friend Ujumwa. I pleaded with her, so she gave me some money. That was how I started this grand old business. To see if I can, I can raise some money and pay my fees. I really need to go back to school. I was with Ugochi today and she told me how her uncle has been maltreating her. That man has been so wicked to her to the extent of sending her only younger brother out to learn mechanic. Imagine. Can you, as in there? Hush! Well, it's not a news in this village. A lot of people in this village know Mazu Zoka is a very wicked man. So, well, the way, that is by the way. So, what do you want to do now? I like that girl. You like the girl? Well, since you like the girl, then go for her now. She's a nice girl. Well, I don't know if she will look at your face so, or even come close to you because since I know that girl in this village, I've never seen her with any man. Well, you can try your luck. I greet you, sir. Yes. Who are you? What can I do for you? My name is Chimobi. I'm here to see you, Gochi. Chimobi. Yes, sir. You want to see Gochi? Yes, sir. What for? What do you want her to do for you? Well, she is my customer. She normally brings granot to our site. Mm. Ugochi! Ugochi! Uncle! Please come. I'm here. This young man wants to see you. Uh, good afternoon. Ugochi, how are you? I'm alright. Who, who is the young man? Who is he? Okay, he's my customer. He normally buys granola from me. Mm. That's why you came to our house today. I hope all is well. All is well. I'm just here to inform you that tomorrow we will be needing enough granite eh? at our site. Really? Hey! <laughs> Thank you very much. I sincerely appreciate it. I will be there. I will be there. Right. God bless you. Take care, huh? Thank you. Bye bye. Uh, take care, sir. Hey, tomorrow will be a very good day for me. <laughs> uh, Ugochi, are you sure it's only granite this young man buys from you? Or is there any other strings attached? Uh, Uncle, I don't understand you. He's only my customer, nothing else. You don't understand me? Yes. Okay. I'm watching. Hmm? I don't understand, but I'm watching. Are you saying that you like me and 
you would want me to be your girlfriend? Ugo, the like is an understatement. I love you. I can't do without you. I, I dream you, I eat you, I wake up thinking about you. Please, accept me and make me the happiest man on earth. Well, I can only accept on one condition. Any condition is acceptable, please. I will be your girlfriend, but no sex. Because I have never done it before. Yes. Huh? You mean you are a virgin? Hey, even not on can come from can. You're a virgin. Ha! That makes it more interesting. I don't, I'm not addicted to sex. Fine, okay by me. Yes. Yeah, no, why not? Accepted. Accepted. That's no problem. It's alright. Yes, so I'm not even addicted to sex. <laughs> yes, so it's okay by me. Accepted. With my whole heart. Sorry. You are very funny. Thank you very much. <laughs> Thank you very much. It's alright. You know you have been eating my granite, so you buy everything. I will pay for even the tray. Don't worry. <laughs> I'll pay I'll buy everything. You are very funny. I like you because Sorry. of that. <laughs> can I can I can I get a hug? No. Just a hug. Let's celebrate this victory. Eh? We just opened a new page. <laughs> just a hug. Sorry. Since I know you in this village, this is the first time you're buying beer. Mm -hmm. The reason is simple. I'm happy. You're happy. You're always happy. But I wonder why today's one is different. Okay, if you must know. Okay. Ugochi has accepted to be my girlfriend. Are you serious? Yeah. Oh boy, you're lucky. Wow. And the interesting part is, <laughs> she said we are not going to let you know. Because she's a bitch. What kind of friendship is that? How can a relationship last long without sex? Nako, <laughs> nako. That makes it more interesting. Because I will end up marrying her as a virgin. Are you no good? Talking of marriage. Oh, you think marriage is just to go and carry women and put in the house? Not here. See, let me tell you the rules and regulations in marriage. Okay. You must make sure you provide for her, feed her well, clothe her, put her in a comfortable place with other amenities to make her happy. For your own case, she she, she she, you don't have. Don't you, your house is empty. You don't have DVD, no foam, no curtain, no television, no fridge. What's on you take it? You can allow nothing. You don't have anything. Marriage commissioner, are mm. you done? I'm done. Let me tell you what you don't know. Mm. Tell me. True love conquers it all. Mm. When we get to that bridge, we shall cross it. I get cross, yeah. The most important thing is that. She has accepted to be my girlfriend. That's what we are celebrating. So, mind what you say to people not give me a You can't have my This drink. way you manage to buy. You can't have my drink. I'm Poor boy, like this way you manage to buy. The lie. You can't try it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy. With well, the life will. Where is everybody? I met no one at home when I arrived. Yeah, okay. Why have you not filled those jars at the backyard with water? Don't you know that my husband and his people will be coming in a few days' time to take me? Josephine, how can you talk like that? Were you not here in the morning when I went out to hawk? And I came back not quite long. And you expect me to feel those drums? So I am talking to you. And you have the God to talk back to me. Well, I know what your problem is. You are jealous of me because I am getting married. Hey, please, Josephine, don't be funny. I, 
Uguchi. Jealous of you. Over what? You are. In fact, Ugochi, I don't just have your time. Leave all these things you are doing. Pack all the buckets and the gallons. Go to the stream and fill all the drums. Do you hear me? Going to the stream to fetch water, I don't have issues with that. But filling those drums, I can't. Don't you know that I'm a human? I went out to hawk. It's not easy. How do I find me to fill the drum? So I am talking and you are talking back with me, even in anger. What is my business about you going to work? Eh? I can't see. Idiots! Don't go and fill those drums today and you will see what I will do to you. Just think. That is the story. Ugochi is not available. But since you people decided to marry from my family, I have another of my beautiful daughter that will suit your son so much for a wife. Let he who the car fits wear it. All right. Can we see her? Why not? She's inside. Um. Ijoma. Ijoma. Papa. Please come. Papa, I'm here. Yes, my daughter. Greet our visitors. Welcome, sir. Welcome. Uh, this is Ichie Ibebwe. And beside him is his son, Amichi. They came to ask for a hand in marriage. What do you have to say? Marry me. Yes. Papa, let me ask you something. When did my name become Ugochi? I was inside when I overheard them telling you that they came to marry Ugochi. And all the lies you told them about her. Papa, why? Why are you doing all this? Why did you hate Ugochi so much? Is this where your wickedness has gotten to? Hey, Papa. The first people came. You gave Josephine to them. And now these people are here for her again. And you want to do the same thing. Papa Ogene, why did you hate to go to so much? Eh, Papa? Please. I don't want you to call me out here next time and tell me this nonsense again. And as for two of you, you don't know what you came for. Hmm? By the time I go inside and come out here again, I don't want to see two of you again. Makana me uniwe, uwa me lina sa una yara kochia. Ndo go futu na futawa. Dama. Mama, what was the meaning of what you have just done? Mama, what I just did? Yes. Mama, I don't understand. What did I do? 
What do you mean you don't understand? Why did you talk to Papa in the manner you did in presence of our visitors? Hey, please, Sister Josephine. I wasn't talking to you. I was referring to you. It's the same thing. Answer her. Why did you reject the man that came to marry you and take him away? Why? May God have mercy on you people because you don't know what you're doing. Anyways, I don't have time for all this nonsense. And as for you, Sister Josephine, so you have the gods to take away your blood sister's future. And you want me, me, Joma, to do the same thing. I will never do that. And let me tell you, you must regret this. You must regret this. Ijoma. Ijoma. Is it me, Josephine? Your own elder sister that you're speaking to in this manner. Ijoma, I can see you no longer have respect or fear for anyone in this house. Don't worry. We shall see. See what? We shall see nothing. Hey! Why is it that if I'm planning something good for this family, Ijoma will be spoiling it with your banje character? Oh, banje! I don't want to see you Papa, I don't want that kind of planning at all. Because there's nothing good about it but evil. Papa, do you have conscience at all? You deprived the Gochi, your own blood brother's daughter, from marrying the sister that came for her, for her hand in marriage. And you said you're doing good for this family. Papa, you are bringing curse to this family. And I don't want to be part of it. Hey. Come back here. Oh. Come back here. Ijoma. Oh, is it me you are walking out on me? Ijoma, you are walking out on me, your father. Hey. Just a few. Talk to your sister. Talk to your sister as I will. Please, 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 Papa. Please, Papa. Don't just involve me in Ijoma's case. Don't involve me in this rat's case because she's going to fight me as usual. Talk to Mama. She's in don't, don't, don't even mention my name. Tell your father to talk to her. She's also your daughter. I don't know. Can I be much where by her for Kamal Mara? Vijay, you're out. Yes. Good morning. Good morning. How are you? Fine, are you? I'm alright. There is something I want to discuss with you. What's that? I hope there's no problem. Not really. It's about the suitor that came here yesterday. Please. I I want you to accept his proposal. Accept him, get married to him, so that all this quarrel with your parents will end. Oh God. Please. Ugo, I woke up this morning very happy and excited. And, and excited. Please. Why do you want to spoil it for me now? I want to spoil it for you. Ugo, the young man came for you and not for me. So if there's anybody in this house, who should marry him? Then that, that person should be you. Oh, well, he later changed his mind. Have you suddenly forgotten? He did. All I want is peace in this house. Ever since that man left this house, your mother has not allowed me to rest. Mikono, just accept his proposal so that everything will end. Ogo, if you don't want me to get upset throughout this week, can we stop this discussion now and forever? Biko. Alright, if you insist, better. Pop, 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 Hey, we'll go to Good afternoon. Afternoon, how are you? I'm fine. Hey, you look so beautiful today. Thank you. You're welcome. Please, let's go in. 
Let's go in. Wait. Listen, you have nothing to worry about, okay? No need to be afraid. You are safe. You know? You are welcome to my humble abode. Your house is fine. Yes. Please don't move. Yes, it's, it's okay. <laughs> Not bad. Alright. What's the man for you? I don't want anything. No. Please, what will I for you? Honestly, I'm fine. You don't look bright. What's bothering you? I don't know what I've done wrong to my uncle. I don't know. Whenever good thing wants to come my way, he looks for every possible means to block it. I don't know why. It's breaking my heart, honestly. So what happened? A few weeks back, someone came to ask for my hand in marriage. He told the person tales about me and pushed the man to his first daughter Josephine. And the man married her. Just two days ago, another suitor came to ask for my hand in marriage again. He still did the same thing and pushed the man to Ijoma. It's just that Ijoma is a very nice person and she turned the man down. But even at that, I, I, it is not nice. I'm more happy about this and this is supposed to be my uncle, my father's brother. It's all right, calm down. That's what I call God's plan. I don't understand. I call it God's plan because all those things have been happening to you because of me. How do you mean? I want to marry you. Oh, please, I don't like it when you joke with me. I'm telling you things that are happening to me. I'm talking about marriage. I'm serious. I want to marry you. Uh, okay, fine. I know you're joking. Let's talk about something else. Have you eaten today? What did you cook? You have food in the house. In fact, I want to eat something now. I want to marry you. Chibobi! Chibobi, please! Uh, this is the first time I'm coming to you. I'll keep making me shine now. I want to marry you. <laughs> After you. <laughs> so, Papa, we have to be on our way now. When Mama comes back, tell her that we came. Huh? It's alright, my daughter. <laughs> I'll do so, eh? Just uh, send my greetings to my mother in law. Tell her that the need that comes back, I'll come and see her. <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> my regards to her own parents, too, eh? Okay. Uh, I'll do. Um, one more thing. Please remind their father. No? Remind them that they have not completed or even paid the dowry. No? I'm still waiting. I'll tell them. No time is later. Okay. I'll tell them. Please. Okay. So I'll leave it to you. Let's look this up. Be careful. Listen, you have to Bye. Okay. I'm still waiting. I wonder what this kind of marriage is. Hmm? How can a girl pack all her belongings and move in with a man who has not paid her bride price? 
My sister is speechless. Your parents supported her. Maybe that's how they want it. But eh, it is a very shameful act. I'm so ashamed of her. Now, okay, up all the pots in your money. You go, guy, or chai, yeah, be cool. You know that Uguchi came to your house yesterday and you told her you want to marry her? Uh, of course not. She came to your house and I looked her eyeball to eyeball and told her I want to marry her. <laughs> so what did she say? Uh, she looked at me and walked out. Meaning she accepted or what? I can't explain that reaction but... I love Uguchi. If she says no to me, my brother, I will die. Okay. Let me ask you. What if she says yes? Are you going to bring her into that your empty room that you don't even have DVD, no television, not even a sound system to... What do you think will be keeping her happy in that house? Good. Let me tell you what you don't know. You see, true love conquers it all. When a woman truly loves you from her heart, she will stay with or without those things you mentioned. Uh, she's not a term material since now. She will be. That one is before, not girls of nowadays. See, so many of them prefer those things even more than their husband. I'm telling you because it, it, it makes them happy more than their husband. I like the way you said it. Some of them, my Ugochi is exceptional. She will stay without material things. Yes. Even at that, you need to do something. Do something like what? My friend, you know what I'm talking about. I said, just have, just go to the market, buy her DVD, television, everything, buy her sound system. Yeah, 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 yeah. Make her happy. Balo will win. You're not a child. Balo will win. I'm saying, I'm telling you. I won't drop a bag because I want to impress. You just have to be talking about her. Yes, I'm saying that. Should I run because I want to buy DVD? Yeah, okay. No problem. No, no. That I'm, I'm worried. Worried about what? Someone asked that I should marry him. So I have been pondering over what we discussed. Marry him. Who is the person? Is he from this our village? No. His name is Chimobi. He's a stranger in this village. Though according to him, he, he said he's from our Marvel community. And what did you tell him? Ah, I have not given him any answer yet. Though I like him. Are you serious? Yes. Is he a nice person? Well, from the little I have seen, he is nice. In that case, I would like to see him. And then I'll take you there. As a matter of fact, that's what I've been here thinking about. I'm sorry I did not come to your room to discuss it with you. It's because of Josephine. I wouldn't want her to hear anything I want to talk to you about. I've told you to leave those people. Forget them. All I want is your happiness. Hmm? So, can we go inside now? Let's go in now. Why are you people outside? No, don't worry yourself. Mm, that's yeah, my sister. I know her. <laughs> um, you don't have to worry. I've only come to tell you something. Hey, but let's go in now. Unlike you, why will you stay outside? 
Okay, you're fine here. Okay. If you insist, I'm all ears. Okay. I have come to tell you that I I have decided to marry you. Mugochi. Hmm? Please. Please and please. I hate pranks. I hate suspense. I hate jokes. I'm, Be serious. I'm not joking with you. I can't joke with such thing. I have decided to marry you. You will marry me? Yes. Hi. <laughs> I like him and he looks very nice. He is. But my problem is that he is very poor. And I wonder how he will take care of you if he finally marries you. I know he is poor, but we love ourselves. The most important thing is love. And I know that God Almighty will provide for us when the time comes. I believe he has a bright future. Bright future? Yes. Ugo, how can you tell me that a stranger that left his own community and came to this village has a bright future? Doing all this messing, all these minor jobs, uh, going all, uh, for all this uh, farm work has a bright future. Ugo, you go the queer. Jim, dear. The thing is that love is involved and God also. I know God will provide for him. I have the strong feeling that he has a bright future. It's not about today, it's about tomorrow. Hmm? Let's forget about this problem. Yeah, just wish me well. So tell me. Where did you learn how to cook granite? Because this year granite is special and sweet. Uh, uh, what makes it special? Mm. Because you cooked it yourself. This top. <laughs> mm. That reminds me. Have you given up on school? No. How can I give up on school? It's just that I've not really made enough money to pay my fees. This business is not really lucrative. I just make some small gain from it and it's not enough to pay my fees. So, oh, if, no, so no. if you see more now, you will go back to school? Yes, I will. I really want to be a graduate. There is no graduate in my family. Don't worry. I've saved up the little money from the little money. I'll do something like that. Really? Mm -hmm. I will be the happiest girl on earth. Thank you so much. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Thank you for you. But I really have to be on my way because I have chores to take care of at home. No, 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 no. Wait now. I'm enjoying our conversation. I know, but I'll give you granite. I know that's what you really want. No, I want you not granite. <laughs> hey, you want that, huh? Uh, mm. Is that one finished? Yes, sir. I'll take. Mm -hmm. But you'll pay, oh. <laughs> I will pay. You'll pay. I will pay. Anyway, I trust you. You don't owe me. Yes, <laughs> What is the meaning of what you just did? What did I do? Hold on, Jokwan. You don't know what you did. Ugochi, how can you step so low to fall in love with this poor stranger that has nothing to show for than going to different building, carrying block and serving medicine? Uh-uh, you're too beautiful for that. So yeah. when has it become your business on whom I've chosen to be friends with? When? I am very, very disappointed. Do you know why? Huh? Because you don't know how endowed you are. Mm. Eh? So of all the men in this village, it is this thing that just left now eh? that you decided to fall in love with. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. Don't call him a thing. And don't shut me up. You don't have that right. Oh. What do you mean that thing? Eh? Are you the one that is going to tell me who I'll be friends with? Okay. But Ugochi, I saw everything. 
Which I stole the hugging. To kiss him I, for everything. I, I did not kiss anybody. Yeah, I only hugged him. Bia, Amaka, what is it? Agatha. What is your problem with the way Ugochi lives her life? Oh. Obasarun? Yes, because she's our friend. Really? Mm-hmm. A special advisor on love matters, sorry. What I am trying to say is that Ugochi, our friend here, is too endowed for that thing that just left. I said, Ugochi, I'm not coming now. Special advisor. Oh, no, I'm a mess. You don't know tomorrow. Why are you calling him names like that? I don't like it though. He's my friend. I don't like when you insult my friend. I don't like it. Ogochi, the only thing I want to tell you now is that Nanda Bain say, me tone the men you make again. Oh no, no, it was that. That guy, go no all the messy, he man. I'm going to force on him and I'll put you three blocks from one building to the other. What about your your boyfriend? What does he do? I don't know. You don't know? He's better than him. Eh. What is your business in her matter? Where is Angurogu in her own case? Yes! I think she should make the right choice. What she should do? Why? Who goes to your mother for that guy? I don't know where that guy is. And that guy is no. Even the woman is no. I don't know where that guy is. I don't know where that guy is. They're just being jealous. And no one will be bothered with any of them and they will not accept. Abi? Don't allow them to disturb you, Biko. What could they go about? Like, even though I'm even tired of it. I don't understand. Greetings, my prince. Excuse me. Alright, quite excuse. The prince is my pleasure, no? How are you, beautiful angel? Please, I'm not your angel. Who are you calling your angel? I don't know why you men like to be insulted before you know that someone does not want you. Well, let me tell you, uh, you definitely need my attention. You definitely do. Please, whatever you want to say to me, you have to be fast about it. Mm. My boyfriend is waiting. You call that... Uh... Richard looking guy, your boyfriend. Anyway, don't worry. Let me show you something. Hold on. Driver. Yes, my friend. <laughs> Have it. And what is it that you bought from me that you want to pay for? What? Actually, I didn't buy anything from you, but... I just want you to have this. Take care of yourself. You know you're beautiful. You look good. I want you to take this money to shop yourself. You know, just for a start. Just do something good with the money. I like you and I want to, you know, be close to you and make you this girl that everyone will want to be in the village. Now Take listen to me. And leave this wretched If this is an insult, you better stop it. I never came to you to tell you that I need money. I am not one of these cheap village girls that go around begging for money. I never asked for your money. And this is going to be the very last time you will stop me on the way to insult me. Do you understand that? Nonsense. Prince, my foot. Nonsense. What did you say? Come on. Call that wretched looking guy your boyfriend. What boyfriend are you talking about? This guy doesn't actually know. What's nonsense? Money is love. Yes, I agree. The truth is now, no matter what, I don't agree with that. Give me the money, I will give her. So, are you sure you can 
talk to her for me. Talking to her is my business already. I will talk to her on your behalf. <laughs> I like this guy. <laughs> he knows what money is. <laughs> yes, thank you. Thank you. Good boy. <laughs> Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. I love this guy. No, let's go. Let's go. <laughs> Now, go wait, go go tell you go do wait. <laughs> wait now, relax. What do you mean wait now? Is this how much you love me? Is this how much you claim to love me? How do you expect me to collect this money? Tomorrow you say you love me. Yet you want me to, to take this money? You want to sell the love we share because of money? It's not like that. I'm doing this for your own good. Yes. How, how do you mean? Fine. You need money. You need to go back to school. I don't have. So use this money. I will handle it later. Please. I know I don't have. And you don't have. So why would you collect this huge amount of money from the prince? A man that I don't like. Talk more of love. What if he comes back tomorrow and says I should give him the money he gave us? How do I pay it back? That's my point. We need this money for now. Use it. When that time comes, I will handle it. When that time comes, you say? Yes. I can handle it. When the time comes, I promise you can handle it. It's only big No, you need it. Whatever comes out of it, I will handle it. Please. The most important thing is that you need to go back to school. You need to take good care of yourself. Please, oh, I won't deceive you now. I'll be calm. Choose that this money is big. Don't worry. I don't want you to get it for us. Nothing will happen to me. <laughs> huh? Where are you putting the money? I don't want my eyes to see it. That place will burn the money. Here. No! <laughs> my sister, I'm so happy. So very happy. Go on in. So you mean all these things happened today? Yes, so <laughs> and Chimu will be collected the money from the prince and gave to you. Honestly, I'm so, still very shocked. So, how will you pay back? That was exactly the question I asked him when he gave me the money, and he said that he will handle it when the time comes. So, handle it? Yes. How? I have no idea. My happiness is that I will be starting school tomorrow. So you'll be going back to school? Yes, that is why I'm washing my uniform. Ha! You don't know how happy I am. Oh. Mm. I've missed school. I've missed school so much. Hey, Obini, great. How come the Kwanye know? Eh? Ogo, I'm still worried. Over what? I don't want you to get into trouble. No, my sister, don't worry yourself. I will never get into trouble. After all, I wasn't the person that collected the money from the so-called prince. So I'm fine, don't worry yourself. Just help me get water, let me rinse my uniform. The sun is shining bright for you Wipe your tears, everything is alright now Forget the past <coughs> yeah, man. Where do you think you're going? I'm going to school. Yes. Have you paid your school fees? Yes. Nine. Hello? Ugochi said she has paid for her school fees. Did you give her money to pay for her school fees? No. No. So, Gochi, where did you get money to pay for your school fees? Because I cannot remember giving you any. Mama, what is it? Why are you wasting our time? Can't you see we are already, already, already late for school? Okay, if you insist to know, she used the money she made from her um, granite business to pay for her school fees. Are you satisfied now? Granite business. 
Yes, my granddad business. <laughs> my. Do you believe her? Vero. Oh. What do you expect me to say? Get this in once again. Yeah? Mm. It's one again. I saw. Vero, why are you shouting? <laughs> Naya, I saw this in Uguchi's bag. We have been living with a criminal in this house. I don't understand you. Nay, you know this morning, after I asked Uguchi how she got money to pay for her school fees, she told me it's from her granite money. Naya did not believe her one bit. So I went inside to search all her bags and I found this money in one of her bags. You found this in Ugochi's bag. Yes, nine. How much is that? Mm. Ugochi. Nine. Seventy thousand naira. What? Seventy thousand naira. Seventy thousand naira. Hey! We have been living with a criminal in this house. Look at it. All right, you know what you'll do? Keep this money in your custody until she comes back, huh? She will explain to us what transpired. Nay, if I did not kill Ugochi in this house today, then my name is no longer Veronica. It's okay. Hey. No problem. So, how far have you gone? Has she accepted to be my own? Why? Huh. I've been talking to her day in, day out. I've been disturbing her about you. And she's responding to me. Oh, really? Yes. Uh, that's good. That means she has accepted to be my wife then. Uh, accepting to be your wife, I can't say. Well, why don't we start with friendship before metamorphosing to wife? I like her so much. In fact, I'm in love with her. And I've been meaning to ask you this. What is your relationship with her? Uh, my relationship with her. She's just my friend. Casual friends here, yeah, that's what we are. Just a friend? Yes, sir. Do you think you can convince her to accept my proposal? Uh, yes, I have been talking to her day in, day out. Okay. Yeah, but uh, um, convincing her to become your wife, mm -hmm. I can't say yes for now, but let's... In fact, she will accept you. She will. Really? Yes, she will. I am very happy now. Udoka. Yes, my friend. Give him the money. Yes, please, just manage that for now. Just manage it. This manage. Ege Jabana, this is manage. Manage. More is coming. Hmm? My friends, in fact, what is no good? No bother. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Hey. Makes him think I can convince Ugochi to marry him. Just like that. Am I Ugochi's mother? To crown it all, he has been giving me money. Hey. How will I deliver this? How will I deliver? Can I handle this? And he has been giving me money. 
Uh-huh. It's not my fault now. Did, did I ask for any money? He's the one that should me money. Uh-huh. I can defend it anyway as you want. Ugochi. 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 I need to name you Kanaka. Found this money in your bag. Where did you get this money from? I, 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 Gochi, you have suddenly become a samurai, eh? <laughs> eh? So you have turned yourself into a criminal and a prostitute in my own house, under my nose. No, Uncle, I, I'm not a criminal. Neither am I a prostitute. So I. I where did you get this huge amount of money from? This money was found in your custody. The money you used to pay for school fees, I did not give you. My wife did not give you. Now tell me, where did you get this money from? Papa, what's all this nonsense for now? Uh -huh. Okay, if you want to know, this money is the, is the money she made from the granite business. Yes, uh, exactly, the granite business. Granite business. You are still talking. I don't understand you. How do you get to know the prince? I don't even know where he's from to this village. Are you alright? Listen. It's not a crime to know the prince. I know. Good. He's rich. He loves Gochi and he wants me to talk to her on his behalf. He has been dashing me money, serious money. Ugochi needs someone like the prince. You know why? Because he's rich. And he can challenge Ugochi's uncle, considering what she's going through in, in, in his hands. Timobi. Can you just listen to yourself? You're just talking blah, 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 blah. Can you just listen to yourself? Yeah. You mean you change the words because the so-called prince has given you money you don't know how to pay back? Now, let me ask you. Mm. How are you going to explain this to Gochi? This rubbish you're telling me now. How are you going to explain it to Gochi? Eh? Gochi will understand and even appreciate it. You know why? Gene. Every girl needs a... I'll give him I'll give him. Timobi. Who is Papa. Mama. Um, what mama. happened? Talk. There's, there's, there's problem. Eh? There's trouble. Yes. yes, in the house. Please. Yes. Yes. So you don't want to talk? Talk now! Talk Where did you get that money found in your bag from? Talk now! Talk oh! Talk oh! Before I pieces you with this sharp contrast! Talk before I shred you into pieces! I shred you with this contrast! Talk now! Huh? Where did you get it from? Talk! 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 What has she done? Why are you people treating her like a slave? Okay, me. What do you think of this going on? What has she done? Why are you people treating her like a slave? Okay, me. What are you trying to do? I don't You pushed me? No, I, I kissed you. Okay. Young man, so you have the guts to enter my own house and push my wife like this? Huh? You're no longer afraid. Afraid of who? Afraid of who now? Do you mean that you're not going to do like this? Huh? Why? What, 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 what has she done? Now you want to know. Oh, if, you, if you care to know, I'll tell you. Tell me. Bye, bye. Yeah. 
Africa. If you get to now, I'll tell you. Okay. Now tell me. Look, 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 at, look at this. This is amount of money. How can a small girl like this have this amount of money? This would be some in her own custody. That money over there was found in her bag. Where did she get the money from? So because of this peanut, you want to disfigure someone's daughter? Yeah. Eh? You don't have the right. If you don't know where she got this money from, call the police. Must you treat her like a slave? Alright, if you must know, I personally gave her this money for her school fees and personal use. You are a liar. By the way. You lie. Now let me ask you. Let me ask you. What do you do for a living? That you can give this amount to a little girl like this? Eh? Commissioner of Police, what I do for a living?